Hi, thanks for tuning in. Uh, this is a short introductory video on how to set up a simple user in the Boris system. So first and foremost, we need to log into the system by entering your user credentials and password here. Once you're in the system, you can see this is the home screen uh, and we have the dashboard. To set up a user, we go to the setup section on the far left hand side and scroll down to users. From here, once you're in, you'll see all the existing users in your system. Now, please remember that users on the Boris system are charged at your agreed rate as per the contract. So we charge on a per user basis, depending on the number of users. To add a user, we just click add user. And here we can select a username. So username John Smith, first name John. password one two three four five one two three four five and if you can make a note of that because you do need to manually send the user the details either via text message if it's an app user or via email if it's a administrator so in this instance the username is John Smith and the password is just simply one two three four five but we do recommend a case sensitive alphanumeric password once that's set up we need to tell the system what is the role of this particular user? And you can see that there's various roles and these are all client specific. So the ones in here which are used most frequently are the administrator. This is for people who are using the system from the, uh, the back end, if you like. Uh, so the, being able to go into the all reports and interrogate data. And we have operatives, which is the on-site installers. And then to allow your customers to see the work that's been done, we have two options for customers. We have customer no prices and customer with prices. So in this instance, we'll select administrator. Generally speaking, administrators are not associated with a customer. So we just leave that blank and then it gives user rights to the entire system. The associated locations is client specific and only used where it's something that we've set up for you within the system. Same with the regions, groups, and the display name on the device is how you want the display name to appear on the device when you log in. So in this case, we just put John. Prefix for installation IDs, that's for the installers or users, so we won't put anything there, but for argument's sake, some companies use a payroll number. If we, if we were setting up a customer, we would select the customer, for argument's sake, no prices. We would then select a customer, so in this instance we'll say Boris Software Limited, and we can even select the location or site. Users, again, if we were setting John Smith up as a user, simply select user, and again, this is not client specific, so we'll remove that. And there you have it, that's how we set up users in Boris. As I mentioned, there are various other roles that we haven't discussed. They're a bit more in depth and they are client specific. So if they're in your list, it's because you've asked us to put them there. So you'll know what they all are anyway. Any more questions regarding users, then please do feel free to call the free phone number where we'll be happy to help. Thank you.